Because I'm so full of good ideas and all that. I am smart. And I also hear a gimme ghoul. Where a gimme ghoul? Oh, I hear the coin too. Oh, he's at the... He's like right here. One coin. He's not on the roof. Right by... Ah, there he is. Right here, yeah. All right, so we can try this again. Tim, what are we doing today? Well, I don't know. We can take out Team Star, do that last gym. Screw around um, in terror raid battles, catch some stuff we don't have. Now I did check the... Because I got done with the last... Uh, Team Star before you. I went out and um, scouted the next one. They're about the same level. Okay, but... Little less, but about the same level. For the star base? Yeah. Which is up north. So that's the gym down there. That's fine. They're a different typing. They're what, ice? Uh, the gym, I think, is psychic. And this, um, team star is fairy. They all... Oh. I got dark. I can deal with fairy. Play steel. That's fairy. Dark is psychic. Uh, you want I poison steel. and steel for psych uh, for fairy. I think. Let me double check the thing I here. I could be wrong too. I just. I put it as some approach to that, so that way people don't think I'm wrong. I said it with confidence. Yeah, fairy, weak against poison and steel. So what, your your jism's gonna be your, um... Probably poison and steel, huh? So jism and graffiti. Mm-hmm. I have no steel, unfortunately. Can't bring you along, that's for sure. I just don't want to bring any fighting, dragon, or dark. God damn it. Fairy hurts fairy, right? It'll hurt it, yeah. <laughs> uh. Super strong shit do I have that I shouldn't have? <laughs> well, I'm gonna head on up to the uh, next area. Okay. So I'm gonna. Fox. There's always a Gimmagool by a Pokemon Center. We can drink! Hi, Jason. Thanks for the sub. 21 fucking months. That's the gear. Get him, Trogdor! I guess I really got nothing. I'll just stick with whatever. I'll use someone that's not. Gotta climb the mountain. Let's see. Bug terror type this thing. The four star, <laughs> let's do it. Alright. On Zen headbutt. I hit the wrong button. But I can go back and hit the right one. <laughs> yes. 
Are you being up the mountain mode? I mean, the moment you get... Oh, you're... Are you playing Scarlet? I think he just runs in Scarlet. Bug type, man. Bug type. Grass. Yeah, I'm assuming fire is going to make this thing's life a living nightmare. <laughs> eh, fuck it. Come on, Talonflame. I'll bring you with. For the funsies. Also, I don't think I have this Pokemon, so we get to name it! So everyone start thinking of names in my chat. This is Bond Suite, isn't it? I think so. Either way, I don't have it, so. <laughs> oh, this could be really good. All the grass Pokemon look alike. Lily Gant. Alright. What did it do to me? Oh, energy ball. One of the... You'll, you'll get that eventually when you do one of the... Uh... uh missions. The HM1. The Herba Mystica mission. Oh, that was me healing myself. That's what it was. <laughs> Bitter Blade oh, heals uh... you. Wow, what are the fire punch? I need to do two more attacks? Oh god, okay. Fuck it! Tailwind, make everyone go fast. Oh, sunny day, brilliant move. Ooh, that does help. And next turn I can terrestrialize. Dude, we're gonna break its shield before we even Pollen Puff. <laughs> A crit. Like fucking Spartan. Behold, I have a candelabra on my head. Still need to do one more attack. Okay. Oh. Kill it! Kill it with fire! What I'm doing! <laughs> Ooh, I created two. You know what I want my grass type to become? Bug. That seems so useful. But I don't have this thing in my Pokedex, so I'm catching it. Flash S. Because I don't think I do. I'm pretty sure I don't either. I caught him. That was the main reason Wait. I did this, so I could get a Pokemon I didn't have in my decks. And, uh, ooh, bug terror shards too. Genius, Feather. Wait, you can do that with the. Yeah, you can at people now if you're talking about titles. I am updating my stream information quick. <laughs> Lilligant. Flowery Pokemon, no matter how much time and money is spent raising it, its flowers are the most beautiful when they bloom in the wild. Yay, I didn't have that. Stealth and Sombra both sent me a. Anyone got a nickname team. for me? So I have two of them in my fucking team. Nice. Uh, what is it like? Bug that, or grass that turns into bug. Ooh, it's got pollen puff. What the fuck is pollen puff? Anyone name? Oh. You can't be confused or intimidated, which is nice. I'm gonna yeah. No one said anything. 
Oh, get in the box. No one wants you. Oh, cool. Hey, meow. That's right. Grab him. Hmm? I didn't even know Drafferig was in the game. Oh, I have one. Never mind. I knew that. Yeah, and it's totally got an evolution, it. apparently, too. Called Ferrafferig well, or something? Yeah, isn't that from... Is, wasn't that in, uh... The, the not Pokemon Pokemon game that was cooler than this? No, it wasn't in Arceus. Oh, okay. Dude, I wonder if I can Cleavor in this. I haven't tried Cleaver. Dude, I want Grass Voltorb. I still want to try that out. I never got to try that out. I'm pretty sure it probably sucks that there was people in the town. What the hell are you? Oh, hi, um... Uh, Swabble... Uh, Altaria. Yeah, the Grass Voltorb was in, uh... uh Arceus. I never used it in Arceus. I, I caught it just enough to get its evolution. Electo Ball. I'm not even going towards the objective. Give me this gimme goal. Items. It had three coins, yay! I didn't even touch you! Fucking die. Hey, I got a level up on one of my Pokemon from killing random things. And it learned to move. Let's see what it learned. Uh. Figure off. Go away. Thunder Punch. Flesh Ender. Nah, it doesn't really help it. He's not a physical attacker. I think that's what it learned. Or was it Magnetic yeah. Flux? Or Dragon Pulse, apparently. Ooh, low kick. You're Lily Gantz, aren't you? The Evolute? No, you are Lily Gantz. Never mind. Done. Bye! Ampharos learned some weird moves. Amphros didn't want you didn't want to see Amphros. Isn't Am Amphros isn't a physical attacker? No, it's special. Oh, shit. I guess I've caught a graveyard. I'll just kill it. Oh, I think I've been here. Oh yeah, this is the town. <laughs> of the yeah. Oh, that was a big cough. I'm sorry. <laughs> no worries. Or sneeze. Here. I always had a habit of making a gimmick of a game or set games and then just throwing it away. It's so frustrating. Well, I mean, to be fair, when they try to change it in this one, this game's gimmick kind of sucks. Well, they, the raids. The raiding in this game fucking Never blows. melt ice. You're already in the ice area, huh? Why aren't you attacking this one? Is it shiny? No, it's not. Oh. It's just slightly off the ground so it wouldn't attack it with just, you know, walking up to it and attacking it. It was a bronzong. I know what those things shinies look like. They're, I think, greenish? That, going to that fight messed up my camera, though. Okay, so they're, they're weirdly different. You would know. Yeah, up the mountain. 
What's this glowing? And it's gone. Oh, Miss Triffus. And it's gone. Oh, there it is. Hey, give me a ghoul. Give me your two coins. Ooh, flamethrower. Ooh. This is the perfect place to train. Overheat. It looks like a dragon trainer. Dragon trainer, dragon trainer. It's either a dragon trainer or it's a dragon or an ace trainer. Yeah, that's a dragon tamer. I love Mega Evolution. Thought it was amazing. They used it for X and Y and yeah, and, uh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire and threw it away. Then you had V Max, Giga Max, which they threw away for Sword and Shield. It's just like, bro, pick some. Yeah. Haha, Ice Dragon. There you go. <laughs> Where are the dang trainers in this area? The opposing enemy is gonna move. Oh, I'm gonna smash you with my hammer. <sighs> that just sounded weird, Harlan. <laughs> that sounded really weird. Yeah. My Pokemon and I were too busy hunkering down against the cold. Your Pokemon was not afraid of the cold. It is an ice-type dragon. Does not care about the cold. Does ice resist ice? I should just put it up. I should put a typing chart up on my monitor. Ice does resist ice, yes. I have okay, a typing so chart up. Is... <laughs> okay. So then ice is... Uh, or So... The ice ice will hit neutral. an ice dragon neutrally. Yeah. Excuse. Fake out. Ah, that does a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. I think Brutal Swing would kill. Fuck it. Get in your ball. One throw catch. Damn it. I'll try it. What Hit are it. you? It doesn't affect Jism. That's oh, a Sylveon. Thank God. It doesn't affect Jism. That's a... Psychic Terra type? Using a dark move against the fairy. I have no um, idea. We'll look at it. Yeah, we'll look at it. Sylveon? Axius. Sylveon, what are you doing? Hey, that's cool, man. If you see the peculiar teeth marks on boulders or trees, it means Axius is likely living nearby. No! See it somewhere? Attack up, special defense. Wow. The Pokemon's competitive spirit makes it deal more damage to a Pokemon of the same gender, but less damage to Pokemon of the opposite gender. Breaking Swipe is a dragon move that I can't... Look at it. The Sylveon is... it's below the world. We'll look at it in the box. Looks like a physical dragon move, though. I assume. It's below the world! Hey, I caught it. I have a Sylveon now. Sylveons are around the world. Uh, wrong button. Bag. No. Box. Uh, there he is. Oh, that was just a really strong Sylveon. That was fairy type. Alright, cool. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Da -da -da -da. 
Uh, let's see, where in the world is Carmen San Diego? There it is. Check somewhere. Yeah, no, the only evolution I'm missing is, uh... Uh, breaking uh, swipe. Uh, call it. Uh, the Sil Espeon. Tough tail wildly and attacks opposing Pokemon. Jancy! Also lowers their attack stats. Huh. That's not a bad dragon move. And the dragon falls. Yeah. Jancy! <laughs> Give me your experience! Oh, the experience. Uh, put my game back up. Thank you. All right. God this is Arlen's crystal. No, nah, I haven't done any EV training. Eh. I'm sure I have a better item for Jism, but I just like I do need to try to catch Jism one of these. Attacks, it just oh, it slightly hurts itself. That's not gonna work. <laughs> Umbreon won't won't kill it. Somewhere's telling me that there is candy and shit. Oh, I didn't do shit. Just, to just do the shit for you. Oh, oh this thing. Oh, it can heal itself. Yeah, <laughs> I it... forgot they could do that. Get confused. Oh, uh... oh, yeah, they make the game super simple. You don't even have to, like, train, EV train or IV train. You can just fucking. God, I think it was the desert. It was just a bunch of feathers. You can just grab feathers and grab that shit. It's all... It's all... Oh, fuck! There's a code that we're supposed to use for something. Because some guy won some Pokemon card tournament. So they gave him a Pokemon in this game. I forgot what the code was, though. I'm trying to figure that out. There was like three codes that came out on Valentine's Day, but one of them was an actual Pokemon. Toad's Cruel? Who the fuck would want to use one of those? <laughs> Says the guy with one in his pack. <laughs> or his team. I was really hoping he would just learn Earthquake, and he had not fucking learned Earthquake yet, and it's so upsetting. Man. Great. Like Pokemon something first. Whatever. I wish I had frickin' full swipe. I'll be at that wouldn't work with the thing that's double edge and it could just kill itself. Up the mountain. Go, Ultra Ball! Come on! Yeah! Huh. Chansey! Was caught. Chansey, Chansey. Hey, Snow Run. Fake Tears. Anyone got a name for this thing? Low Sweep. Name the Chansey. Love, 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 happy Valentine's, and first champion. Mimsy, okay. I don't know if she would like that. Well, you can blame Jason for it, because he's the one that named it. Oh, it actually had an oval stone. <laughs> She brings happiness and heals everyone. 
Well, I was looking at the negatives. Sir. Why don't I just drop in that Pokemon Center? Maybe working at the oh, Pokemon Center here would be more fun than my current job. Down by Esther, the office worker. Oh, no, I don't want to... No, no. No, 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 no. I don't want to fight you. I don't care about you. Thank you. Come here, Candy. Oh, this is a bad matchup. A three-star something that's water. Oh, seed. Has Simeon. I received. The first champs one is the app. Comes at level 50. It's the Pokemon that he used to win the tournament or whatever. I forgot what it was, but... Take that, Metacham. Giggity leveled up! Oh, Stone Edge, the uh, the Crush Me Daddy uh, rock Pokemon. Oh, fuck. I was looking away. No one likes you, Litleo. That's a lie. It's not Stone Edge, it's Stonehenge or something. It's some play on Stonehenge. I saw a clip of someone playing, what was it, God of War Ragnarok and fighting the Valkyrie Queen, which does the attack where she, like, pounces on you and steps on your throat. He just goes, STEP ON ME, MOMMY, as he kills her, <laughs> as she kills him. Oh, no, that's I, the one I think, yeah, I think he's, I'm thinking of a different one, the one that been around for a while. This, he's doing that new salt, I think he used that new salt Pokemon. Oh, oh, there's the base, why don't I just jump in? You're not getting yeah, away, Chansey. I don't know what the evolution of that new salt one is. Knackle Stackle or something like that? Yeah. It's, it's like that one. <laughs> Give me your experience, Chansey. I'm gonna die. I'm here. So the Ice Cube had Penguin Pokemon. This is Timmy G's crystal. I gotta look at the map. Am I actually getting close? What the fuck is this area? Why are we get- oh my god, I'm at the fucking poison base. Alright, cool. That's why I'm getting all lag central. Yeah, that area is pretty laggy. It's forgetting everything! Perfect! Mm. What kind of crystal was it, Harlan? That it was, looked like ice. Mm. Hey, I caught a SQ. Ice Q. Ooh, move for Confi. Close combat. Gotta study hard. Let's whip this kid. Uh, mm. Regret the moment. Talking to me. Unani, the student. Unai, sorry. Oh, jump pluff? And yours ain't even shiny? What the fuck? Crush it. Well, we'll fake it out first. Dude, I'm gonna kill Jism in this battle. Oh my god. Yep. I'm not thinking of Star. I can't remember its exact name, but it's based on Stonehenge. Uh, Stone Junner? Yeah, that one. Uh, sorry, it's gonna kill itself. <laughs> what happened to Jism? The experience. What the hell? What, what the hell did my game just do? <laughs> if you lick the ice covering his face, you'll find it has a faintly salty taste. The species rode here on ocean currents from a cold, faraway land. Anyone have a nickname for my ice cube penguin? Oh, I gotta select a Pokemon? Gross. Toadspawn? <gasps> Pupitar! 
Let's spore it. Behold, I now have a jism in my party. <laughs> nice. Because it has a salty ice block on its face. Okay. Okay. Kill it with fire. It's a sunflora. Sunflora. The power of music. You're the black label of voice trainer. By Titania, the musician. Wiggly tough, wiggly tough. Umbreon. Really? Jism you know, would have been great for them. Four. Let him go first. Oh. Aw, oh, you son of a bitch. It sent out an Umbreon, huh? And it taunted. Asshole. Hey, Jailbait leveled up. Die. Grumpig. I think I may have just sent out the wrong Pokemon here. Una, the student. Unai with chain. God damn it. Fucking sus. It's in a goddamn vent. Oh! It's a. Okay. How do I it not it, it kill turned you? out okay. Uh, 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 I don't have any quick. I do have quick ball. Quick ball! Dude, I was. Tr Dude, the Among Us was hiding. It was an imposter. Holy shit! Did you go to attack an Among Us and it turned into a Zerowa? <laughs> yeah, dude, it was an imposter! Fuck! That's actually really cool. That's actually funny. Imposter was an imposter. So this one has to be named Sus if you catch it, right? Right. Ow. I was gonna give it a premiere mall. How do I not? Bow to the power of music! Lonely Mint! Ooh, that's actually a good one. That's the attack up one. Don't knock my shit off. I don't think I actually have anything on Toad's Prom. Knock it off indeed. I wasn't paying attention and ran into a Pokemon. No, let's give it a premiere ball. Not, Not even gonna waste my time with you. Fine, I'll try to damage it. Such beauty. I think this will kill, but whatever. Such beauty only be marred by the ugly piles of junk. I can't stand it. Alright. Desiree, the, the artist. The No, you fainted it. I already got one of you. I don't need a replacement. <gasps> Up the mountain. I 
I just one-shot your Pokemon. How does that make you feel, lady? Sorry, sorry. I guess I shouldn't have taken out my frustration on you. No, you should not have. The primate. That's a bug. What's the red? Oh, that's the lucha. A lucha. Ah, no! Yes, you can. Well, glide for a distance and then fall. Oh, yeah. Blissey? Oh, Blissey. Oh, God. Big old Blissey. Wait, what? I missed the Blissey and hit this stupid floatiti thing behind it. I mean, it still gave me a lot of experience. And the Blissey despawned. And she despawned. Why do I keep wanting to go over? I don't want to go over there. That brings bad memories. I don't want to go over there. Fuck that, Jim. So, are there any static encounters in this that are like hidden away? Oh, you mean that you'll always find them in spots? All the glowing ones that you see, they'll always come back. I don't know what their respawn time is, but yeah. Um, and then apparently you can catch the giant forms of all of these. Put, like all the Herbamysticas in the second time. I don't know why I decided to want to fight me. I just need Stupid Grim Snarl. To kill. Take that. You I need to kill. Them. No, I'm still nervous. There was such a big step. It's a picnic to panic to Yeah, death. the alpha Pokemon. It's... it's... If you've done any of the quests for the alphas, fugitive, thanks for that. Fifteen months in a row. How you doing tonight, man? Abbreviate her by Mystica. Suppose I should do this. Yeah, Tim taught me that one. <laughs> what did I teach you? About abbreviating Herba Mystica. Hmm. Barriers, no need to use Ooh, look at this gear. shiny rock. It looks Arbonara so sounds awesome. I don't know why it went that way. I need to go this way. Is there a Badoof? I don't know if Badoof is in this game. I haven't seen one. And probably not. We haven't seen it yet. HM Slave for life! Give Jason a little shout out too since he's been here for a while. Climbing up a mountain. Oh, I found the sword in the rock! You're not getting away, Chansey. Ooh, you found one of the. those things. When you pull the snake out, it crumbles and changed. My giant toothpick, no. We're in here. Still pissed that frickin' Blissey got away on me. Wait, what? Why is there a mark? Did I put a marker here by accident? No. Maybe. I'm gonna go heal and assault the base, Harlan. Wish me luck. I fucking okay. I hate myself, dude. What'd right, you do? Where's the Where's the actual base? It's right there. 
I put a marker down at some point by accident and went to it. Goodbye. Lovely prize, Leaf Storm. I don't want fighting dragon and dark in my group. The <laughs> teddy Earth is in the mountain. Oh, he's fixed. Alright, cool. Have you been battling people? Have you been uh, shutting the hell up? So let's go Trogdor, Giggity, and Jailbait as my party. Don't touch it. Mine. Leech light. Ooh. A really good bug move nowadays. Huh. The John's team started using the first three Pokemon in your party? Yes. I really don't know if Beef the people giving away items are actually worth it. Even the small not. stars can light up the sky when they shine together as constellations. We're the last bastion of Team Star. Losing isn't an option. Hey kid, you listening? You beat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes? We'll call you, We'll call the boss out to deal with you. How's that for hospitality? Bring it on, losers. Three, two, one. Start. Go get him, Giggity. Oh. Wiggly Tufts can float. The fuck? Yeah, I mean, they're both balloon Pokemon. I, I suppose. Guess. I just never seen them float. Oh. Oh. Lycan Rock. Gardevoir versus Jailbait. This is going quite well. No. Give, me, give, me, give me, give me the coin. Give me the coin. Give me gold. Ow. The emo Pokemon, go. Yeah. That was for two. And a max of that. Yeah, I don't think anybody took even damage there. Our defenses are breached. It's all up to the boss now. Yeah, you're doomed. Doomed, I tell you. Doomed! Oh, it's got hearts on it. No, no, don't want you. Ortega! No. Oh. Burmite. Am I being attacked by one of the te uh, Team TriStar 2? Oh. No, so you're Timmy G. Okay. Talk about underwhelming. I was expecting someone, I don't know, more a little more beefed up. Oh. But are whatever, I don't care who you version? are. Not like I'm going to lose to you anyways. You think fairy types are all but cuteness. You're in for a nasty surprise. It is. Let's see if a quick ball actually works. I think that's the first form of the one you got. Yep. Alright, cool. It's off the decks. You are challenged by Ortega of Team Star. I'll just think you're better than mine. Meryl! Oh, what a perfect start. Go giggity. Promise I'll play nice, so don't blame me when the battle sends you blubbering back home. 
I can set up here. Charm. Attack harshly fell. Mm. Shame. Icy wind. I can breath, focus, energy, and boit. boost the attack to have when the Pokemon hit by fire. Which is exactly it. Special attack down. The death up. Good. One more turn to get up. Toxic spikes. <coughs> Up. Oopsie! Fine. You just realized how outmatched you are? If you want to give up, now's the time. Yeah! <laughs> you just healed my giggity. You fool. You fool! It's Pika Blue's evolution. It is indeed. Dragon Riolu. Wigglytuff. Nah. That doesn't seem that good. I haven't caught a Riolu, Riolu, but I can't join you for a while, unfortunately, because I'm in the middle of the Team Star battle. Fucking I Body slam! Lucario can learn Dragon Balls? Is there like a Dragon Punch? Oh, I wonder if we could do Breaking Punch. No. Come on and slam! You got the paral paralysis off. Wow. Oh, but the poison's gonna kill you anyway, so. <laughs> Sneezes, defense fell. Oh. Dash bun. Nah. <laughs> You're poisoned, sucker. I obtained a thousand life points. Crunch! No. I've never actually used these. Even though they're good. I should one time. During a playthrough or something. Send to the box! I don't know you get Sneasel so late sometimes that it just... Why? Um, take that, Dash Bun. I'll take it on to myself. Oh, I put challenge as a group. All ready to go. Start raid. But now, now I don't get that one, Harlan. Well, I thought you said uh, you could join me for a while. Yeah, but I wanted it. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I wasn't gonna wait. No, Giggity! You did so well, but you have fallen. I mean, I'll attack again, even though... Well, all of its health just disappeared and it came back. You're in charge! Go, us. Trogdor! Pokemon rating is just so good and works all the time. You confoozled me. How dare you confoozle me. I was really shocked. I had made a prediction that they were going to let you change out Pokeballs for Pokemon you've caught. And they never let you do that in this game. I was really shocked. I, I'm like, that's gonna be the one thing, the one little thing. Be like, you don't like it in a Pokeball? Let's just throw it in a luxury mall. Oh, cool. It hurt itself in the confusion. No. 
Come on, it's almost dead. Get, snap out of the confusion. Yes! Roach Boss Starmobile. I have destroyed it. The opposing Reverum fainted. You have defeated Ortega of Team Star. He's having a temper tantrum. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think we'll have to see what it does when it evolves, but that Ugh. it has no nature. How could I lose? What the heck? But then again, you can just buy a nature for it. Because you had a disco ball on your car. This about a year and a half ago. Ark, what the heck? Your toy car didn't budge an inch, huh? Told you it's not a toy, it's called the Starmobile, and I was up all night building it. Problem's clear, you're not giving it enough juice. You designed this thing to be powered by two car cadets, but it's just too heavy. Just a shame, I wanted to see the looks of our bullies' faces once it got moving. I'm sorry, I really thought it would work. Come, good fellow. Tis no occasion for melancholy. Why to make such a remarkable contraption by thine own hand? Genius, thy name is Ortega. Yeah, well, that, there's no point if it doesn't work, is there? If I'd known all this effort would be have zero payout, I'd just ask Mother to buy a car for us. See, this is why you don't take you People don't take you seriously. You just say stupid things, you know that? What? Mela, cool it, would you? Yeah, how about no? I mean, we even put this in the code for crying out loud. Or started Team Star, we sort of quit relying on our parents for bags of cash to fix our problems for us, or did you forget? That hunk of junk doesn't move, get it moving. If we're short on juice, just gotta crank up the power somehow. Doesn't take a genius, man. Is he enough to say, Melly? Do you have an actual plan? Yep. I'm gonna train up my carcade and have them evolve. Their boosted firepower will get the Starmobile moving, no sweat. But the hour of Operation Star is nigh at hand. Will you succeed in time? Maybe. <laughs> I just killed. Oh, myself. I'll get it done. Melly, wait. You know, Mella shoots her mouth off an awful lot, but she means well. I know. God, this sucks. What are you fighting that went to uh, terrestrialize on you? Uh, there's, uh, the, uh, what do they call it? The Rever Room? Ah. With the Terrorized. I just ah. found it. Saying, Let's see what it's about. It lowered its special attack. This thing's usually a physical tank. Let's ice beam it. For this fun. sucks. I hate myself for losing, but I also can't get over how awesome you were in that battle. Any of those squad bosses are defeated, that means we have to step down. And going against our code would make me a traitor to the team. Yeah, fine. Not like I have any choice anyway, so take the badge already. You better treat it with the respect it deserves. I take half damage from this. I'm not done yet. Here's my favorite TM2. Feel free to marvel at how awesome it is. Dazzling Gleam. Hmm. I already have that, though. As you know, you're the worst, like the most annoying person ever. But I get it. You're super strong. I'll admit that much. You even busted up my Starmobile. Young Master Ortega. Mr. Harrington. Guess it's time for my piano lesson, huh? So it happens, I just lost my boss title, so I'm all in good to head home. Uh, actually, a different matter brought me. Somebody I'd like you to meet. He's a distant acquaintance. He's a distant acquaintance of mine. The name's Clive. Okay, what's your business here? I want to tell you. I want you to tell me something. The son of a wealthy family and heir to a major apparel company, so why join a group like Team Star? What a question to ask someone you've just met. Well, my answer is the same as everyone else in the team, because I was being bullied. So the Academy really did have an issue with bullying. Who would guess, right? The school's all rainbows and butterflies these days. The boys from back then don't even go to the Academy anymore. Why? What happened to them? As a, the former director of the Academy, I believe I am best positioned to answer that question. Mr. Harrington? About 18 months ago, the members of Team Stark and run the students who used to bully them. 
An altercation broke out between the groups. Then it escalated into a major incident. The altercation nonetheless caused a scandal of hitherto un unknown proportions. As a result of what occurred that day, the students who had perpetrated the bullying dropped out of the academy one after another. Are there any records of that anywhere in the academy? No, I should imagine not. My former deputy deleted all records of the incident, you see. <coughs> what? Why would anyone do that? Just I was puzzling over how to best deal with Team Star in the aftermath of the incident. A certain student came to see me. The student declared that they would take all responsibility for the team's actions. Strange, they requested I exonerate the other student of Team Star from any blame. Huh? No, no one told me that. I accepted the request and agreed not to take the disciplinary action against Team Star. Then I assigned 18 months of overseas study to the student who took responsibility for the team. A year and a half of studying abroad? This was not intended as punishment, you understand. Team Star were the victims, after all. I want a student to take some time to rest, so I had them return home to the Galar region. Under the pretext of overseas study. Around that time, however, the former deputy director took it upon himself to erase all traces of the incident from the academy servers. It appeared as his attempt was to shield himself from any blame. We tried to cover up the whole thing? That's terrible. We discovered what he had done. I dealt him the with him appropriately, of course. But the inability of myself and the rest of the teaching staff to prevent this terrible act also prevented a grave blunder on our part. I accepted the blame that lay at my feet and resigned from my position as director. The rest of the teaching staff then joined me in handing in their notices. So that's why all the teachers were bright in a year and a half ago. I understand my actions have caused you a great deal of trouble. You have my sincerest apologies. Hang on, Mr. Harrington. How come you suddenly decide to talk about this now? Young Master Ortega, Team Star cannot carry on its current fashion. I really wish to give you a chance to chart a better course. There's no way I'm abandoning my friends and going to the school without them. Not after we've come this far. Your friends and Team Star must mean a great deal to you. Isn't that obvious? It's because, you know, they're my greatest treasure in the whole world. Flippity! Hmm? I know there's a flip baby. I should know that. Are you the one that died like a hundred years ago and caused that guy to go insane? No? Okay. Roto -to 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 -to. Jimmy G, it's me. You did it. You did you claim Ortega Star Badge? With its boss no longer on the Rooch Boss squad is as good as finished. So Ortega was the last. All five squad bosses have been toppled with their <laughs> from their pedestals. I had to leave Team Star before long now that they've lost their special positions. After that, they should be back attending these classes at the Academy. Nice work out there, Timmy G. Is that Clive I hear? Cassiopeia, well done to you too. Thanks, now, about your award. I'll transfer some LP over to your phone, as promised. 20,000! More kinds of TMs! Oh, that reminds me, I'm doing the whole supply unit rep thing this time, right? Indeed, you can go ahead and give Timmy G his bonus reward now. <coughs> Long last, Operation Starfall has entered its final stage. There's only one thing left on the agenda. You must defeat the big boss and have Team Star disband for good. Where's the big boss? Don't worry, there's no need to search them out. The true identity of the big boss is not a yeah. Obviously. I'm sorry. Didn't mean to keep it from you for so long, but the right moment never came. I'm the one who formed Team Star back then. That remember the team were my closest friends, and I treasured them more than anything. If they go in like this, Team Star won't do any good for anyone. They've got to give it up, so I'm using the code we made together to force them to disband. I've been waiting for you at the schoolyard after dark. You should come as well, Clive. Understood. And I'll see you both there. So Cassiopeia was the big boss of Team Star this whole time? I scarcely thought it was po thought it possible. I've been saying that the whole time! But with this revelation, I just might have an inkling as their true identity. 
Teams will find our answers after dark in the academy schoolyard. Let's prepare as best we can before heading over. Yay, I did it. Now I think I'm gonna go do the last gym. Mr. Harrington! Oh, it's the, the end of the evolution. Which is very dark. Grimmsnarl? Yeah, that thing's annoying. <laughs> 